As we know, we know in 2014, and people are still talking about David Penhalligan, and, and so um, he's obviously left a legacy that's, you know, from his time as a member of Parliament. to know a little bit more of the legacy that he left Cornwall. He was very well respected. And he was probably the most impressive speaker I've ever heard. He was funny, intelligent and had an audience in his control all the way through. His success in the 1970s was able to actually transform an area of Cornwall from an area where the Liberal Party was actually quite weak to a dominant stronghold by the end of that decade. And that was something which is obviously very important in terms of understanding the political importance of what he actually achieved. He was able to emerge as a natural champion of Cornwall. He was able to engage with the, the people of Cornwall, but was also able to project this into a national audience via the television. He came along at the very time when television was playing a very important role in popularising politics and promoting it to a much more wider audience. Our project aims to create a permanent online archive to the memories of David Penhalligan. The Liberal MP for Truro between 1974 and 1986 is well known with people in Truro, in Cornwall and around the country. Our website will allow people to upload personal memories of David to ensure that these are not lost. Your money will go directly into building and maintaining the website and will allow us to do interviews all around the country. The more money we have, the more successful a project we can run and we hope that this will be something that will last and continue.